YouTube. It is Tanya, and um, it is week four. Um, kind of been a lot of changes. Um, if for all of y'all that have been following me, um, y'all know that I went down almost 30 pounds, and as soon as I come back from the hospital, I stayed the same for three weeks I guess three weeks um, and actually the last week I went up like seven or eight pounds and it, it was really really scary and um, sorry about all the bumps we're on the way to the doctors now this is my one month one month um, checking and seeing what you know what's all going on and, and how I guess I get to go to soft soft foods today but anyway i um, not going to make this real long, but did kind of want to tell you what was going on. Um, I called the doctor. I was really concerned about gaining weight. I didn't understand how I was gaining. Um, of course, you know, I went through all of that with some of my previous videos. Um, but I did. I, I, was, I gained seven or eight pounds back of what I had lost. Um, but as of right now, I am back to exactly where I was when I come home from the hospital after all the swelling so um I've actually lost that seven or eight pounds you know granted I'll, I mean I'll take that even though um it is what I had already lost at least it's gone I'm back on the right track um drink I'm able to actually drink more water and um actually I do have a little I know a lot of you have said I've seen in your post and, and stuff um, where you're having a hard time getting your water down. Well, I had a horrible time getting my water down. Um, I I tried all kinds of stuff. I tried different size glasses. I tried to drink so much and so amount of time. I just, I mean, I, I just tried all kinds of different things. I tried different, different liquids like, you know, Powerade. Of course, I still drink my Powerade. Um, but getting the amount that the doctor wanted me to have. I'm still not at the amount that the doctor wanted me to have, but I have found something and I am so super excited about this. And y'all are gonna think that I am so off my rocker when I tell you about it, but um, I love it. And I wouldn't trade nothing for it and I'd pay three times the amount that I paid for it um, because I, I love it just that much. Um, I know y'all seen these water bottles, you know, around. You see them Walmart, you see them everywhere, GNC, you see them everywhere. Um, I've tried all of them, it seems like. Um, these particular ones, you know, that seem, you know, they just seem like they, um, they sweat. So, I thought, oh, I don't want to go there. Um, all of them say, well, you know, it'll keep your, they're insulated, they keep your stuff cool, da 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 Well, everyone that I've ever opened and looked at, I, I couldn't tell where there's no insulation. You know, I mean, it was just as thin as the outside as the inside. You know, it's like my fingers could have touched each other. But, um, I did find this at Belk. I was a little hesitant because of the material that it's made out of. Um, I thought that thing's going to sweat, it's going to drive me crazy. Um, and I just, I, I ain't gonna like it, but, um, anyway, this is Under Armour. I don't know if you can tell. It, it actually has the, um, the padded. So I thought, well, if it does sweat, it won't be so bad. It's guaranteed to, um, keep your water cold, cold, cold for 12 hours. And that was another issue of mine. I can, I can drink water, but once it starts getting room temperature, I don't want it. So it's like I was constantly going back and changing my water out, which was, making me have a hard time keeping up with the amount as well so i found this and they actually have them in different colors and they have them in different sizes and this one is actually a 24 ounce one um and it is guaranteed it is um i, don't, I can't remember if it said double insulated or insulated but the insulation when i put my hand in it is about that thick and it does not sweat which floored me because I knew that'd be the first thing I wouldn't like about it. It does not sweat at all. Um, it 
I put some ice in it and some water in it, and I thought, well, okay, by the afternoon it'd be done, you know, pretty much warm temperature. You know, I'll give it eight hours, but let me tell you what. I filled it up. Um, I've had this for three or four days now. I filled it up the first morning, and three or four o'clock that afternoon, you know, I was drinking some more, and I was like, man, this thing is still cold. Um, later on, about eight or nine o'clock that night, you know, I showed it to my husband. I was like, try this. It still had ice in it. It was freezing cold water. It was excellent. Keeping on the nightstand beside my bed, woke up the next morning. Yeah, it's got to be done by now. Opened it up. Took a swallow out of it. Ice fell in my mouth. Still ice in the container. It, it's the bomb. It is the bomb. It was $29.99. It was $30.00. But it was well worth it. And I have bought a ton of these things over the years. A ton. And I would pay three times the amount for this right here. Um, one thing about it is is that it's, it's, it's leak proof and it's, it's vacuum. It's, it's got like a, a vacuum top. And I think that's what helps it stays cool. Um, it just kind of pops open like, you know, let's see if you can see that or not. It pops open like that. You push this button that pops open and then you drink <laughs> it's good anyway um, I would recommend this I did find this one at Belk you can probably find them at um, I would say Dick's or something someplace like that but um, anyway for y'all that are having a hard time getting water I know that this water is going to stay cold for me I know I don't have to change it out I know that when I'm done with this one I've got 24 ounces down fill it back up here we go again you know um three of these got my water in i'll be lucky if i get two but you know we working on two let's put it that way um but anyway that was just a little um a little punch in there i wanted to give you like i said i don't want to stay long we um i'm getting real excited all right well fixing to go like i said we're on our way to the doctor um our last day of well not mine but um my husband's last day of work was today and we are going on vacation for two weeks two weeks y'all so i hope that um i hope i don't gain any while i'm gone that's going to be the big, biggest thing but i am going to try to keep you updated and um we are going to the beach and um i'm excited i can't wait i want to go get my tan on baby uh, <laughs> got to go do some fishing got to got to go pulling them big boys you know that bass fishing is good but till you get out there in the ocean mm, it mess you up right there it really will um especially when you're pulling in a big old king mackerel and a shark comes up behind it and bites half of it off um got some pictures of that that was that was kind of cool um but anyway, we love it, so we're going to do some deep sea fishing, and we're going to do some beaching, and we're going to do some school shopping, and we're going to do some eating, what well, little bit that I can, but of course I'm going to try to keep everything like I'm supposed to. But, um, take all my vitamins, everything I'm supposed to do, been doing all that good, get in some exercise, and, um, so we are excited. Let me show you how excited my family is. Look at my daughter. Hey, daughter. <laughs> now here's my husband look at his excitement pumped pumped, pumped. anyway we're going um, fishing we're going fishing so he's happy so um after, run off the road. after this little trip to the doctor we are going home getting ourselves packed probably overpacked and we are headed out the door so like i said i will get in touch with you but we will be beach bound Alright, talk to you later, and if you have any questions or anything, just leave it for me, and I'll be glad to get back with you. Talk to you later. Bye.